Hi guys and welcome to Rolo RC. Here we are, we're out in the desert uh, and we've got four cars with us today. Um, the primary car we're bringing out today to test is the Mojave uh, 6S EXB. We've just stuck standard electronics in it. We've had one shakedown run on the car park just to make sure everything's running. Today we've put on Proline Dumont tires on the back. We've got the standard Fortress on the front. We've also got with us the usual suspects, the Creighton EXB, we've got the Sledge and we've got the Fire Team. And we might also have a little race with these cars a little bit uh, later on. But first of all, we're starting off with the Mojave. So the Mojave now, in its element, it's completely standard other than I've raised the ride height because uh, as per usual, this is pretty bumpy here. I haven't changed anything, just shoe glued the body. When I say shoe glued, I use uh, E6000, it's cheaper and it works really well. Um, and drywall tape. Paddle sound good. All my wheels are attached here. Let's go gyro up. Big, big jumps there. Somebody's been hammering my nice little jump spot. Very harsh. Thought I lost steering there, but... Uh... I've never lost there. Uh, got some damage to the front steering. No. Harsh terrain. I think I need to find a better place. Oh, nice. Look at the state of these ruts here. I think I need to find a better place. This is not a good place. As you can see, it's getting bogged down in those big ruts. <laughs> Epic. Really harsh there. Gets through it, but it doesn't like it. See, one of the first things that I did, that's this little uh, lanyard snapped off. I've got some spare ones at home, thankfully. We're a brand new car. got that metallic EXB sound to it. Just getting over those big divots. I think any car's going to struggle through this. Look at it. Just looks so cool blasting through the desert though. Got the gyro off. Oh, well, that was a bit silly. So, definitely, this requires like a totally different kind of driving style to what I've been getting used to. As you can see, a lot of traction rolling. And um, let me just try to turn the gyro on. Now. It's correcting itself much more, taking a wider line, but it's not losing it. So actually nice with the gyro. 
to stop me having to chase after it. You can see the gyro working there. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. I'm going to bring it close in. I'm not, um, if I don't steer and just run it straight, look at the wheels. Constantly left, right, left, right, left, right. Let me turn the gyro to half. No steering. Okay, just the, yeah, that's better, like gyro in the middle. It's still uh, correcting a lot. Look at that. Jump out the way. Nearly took myself out. Oh, it's still got a traction roll. Big rut. Nice. Nice little car. 